This year is extremely special for Princess because in 1965 we started and obviously being 2015 it's our 50th year and the celebration of 50 years and the journeys that we've taken along that road is massive. Princess is a wonderful organisation and we are very pleased and proud to have worked with them for the last 20 years. Uh, we congratulate them on their 50 year anniversary. I think we are one of the more successful worldwide boat builders. Um, we employ over 2,000 people uh, here in Plymouth uh, based on five sites around Plymouth. So our first boat that Princess produced was the Project 31. Since that moment we've developed numerous new models which have increased in size, increased in complexity and now we produce a boat that's 132 foot, 40 metres in length. We work very closely in collaboration with uh, Bernard Lozinski based on the Isle of Wight. Everybody that works here cares and loves the product and you can't help but get involved. You can't, it kind of becomes a family and it's that that we try and portray in our boats. It's the love of the boat, you know, the passion that goes into developing the boat. They want to get that product absolutely perfect so that when it goes onto the boat, when it's at a boat show and when it's being used by the customer, they appreciate exactly what we've done in terms of putting our passion into the product. Our customers come back to us time and time again. What I'd like them to be saying to each other is just how much they're enjoying their boat and, and what a great purchase it is. We pay an awful lot of attention to detail um, and it doesn't really matter whether the detail is in how you design a cutlery drawer, shall we say, or how you design a boat layout or a flybridge layout, how you design a hull, how you, how you stiffen the hull, how you get the right performance out of it, how you um, define the equipment package. You have to do everything you possibly can to give the ultimate value in the product you're producing. A good example of the way we approach the, the design process uh, is the uh, coffee table, the 88 motor yacht. The concept for that would have been drawn from an overall concept of the interior scheme. We all sit down and hand sketch various ideas. We then get together as a team and pick the most appealing, most exciting designs. From that moment, that needs to become digital and NX and Team Centre in terms of our sign-off processes, in terms of our modelling capability, that's helped us to design product to the nth degree to give our customers the extra touch of detail. Team Centre is massive in terms of how we review, how we sign off and how we not only finish the final design but agree that for production. The business pressures we face are developing great products uh, within a time frame um, and it's time to market is one of our greatest pressures. One of the benefits of NX is the, is the speed and ease that we can change and manipulate the design so we, we can create a rough concept model and then very very quickly use synchronous modelling to manipulate that part. It's absolutely vital that the work we do gets transferred properly into the end product and it's my belief that the right software is a major link in the chain. The rest of the chain is useless without the right software. Our long-term partnership with Siemens has helped us improve and drive quality, uh, reduce our lead times and enable us to focus on what's really important to us, the design and the craftsmanship. Siemens have been a great partner of ours. We've changed our database, we've looked at new formats, we've even changed the, the methods of modelling. What we try and do, and I think succeed in, in, in large measure, is deliver a very personal service such that the people that we bring in and engage with and look after the customer get to understand their business extremely well. They get to understand the business drivers, the challenges, and then work on personalised solutions to meet those challenges. Thank you, Princess, and congratulations on your 50 years.